Hi, my name is Lisa Allen. Welcome to English Lesson. En esta lección tenemos un objetivo, evaluar y comparar con adjetivos en frases como not, enough y to. El uso de esta frase es nuestro conceptual, contenido conceptual. El profesor de inglés va a explicar un proyecto especial para la clase. Empezamos. Let's begin with our English lesson. Evaluating and comparing with adjectives. Let's begin with the phrase not enough. Where you see the little dots, that's where you put an adjective. For example, well, let's talk about what this phrase means first. Not enough means not sufficient. You want more of that adjective. For example, not good enough. What does it mean? You want something better. Not cool enough. You want cooler. Not big enough. You want bigger. Not cheap enough. You want it cheaper. The opposite phrase is to and an adjective. For example, well, let's look at the definition again. Excessive. You want less. Too tall. You want less tall. Too expensive. You want it cheaper. Too far away. You want closer. Too noisy. You want quiet. Not enough and too are opposites. Let's look more closely. Not good enough. The soccer team was not good enough. What does that mean? They were not good. The soccer team, their skill is low. You want their ability to be higher. Good. So the soccer team was not good enough. Another example with too. Too hot. July was too hot to be in school. What does it mean? July is too hot. Way up here, hot. You want the temperature lower. A good temperature, comfortable to be in school. July was too hot to be in school. Some other examples. Here, you see a little clock. The clock is not big enough. It means you want a bigger clock. The alarm is not loud enough. That means you want a louder alarm. Another example. The iron is too hot. You want it cooler. The iron is too big. You want a smaller iron. Let's look at another example. You are thinking about buying a new house. Here's your house plan. Tell what you think about this house. Evaluate and compare using the adjective phrases. In the plan, you have every room labeled. Kitchen, cocina, dining room, comedor, etc. Let's look at some examples. The kitchen is not big enough. Means you want the kitchen bigger. The master bedroom, cuarto principal, is too small. You want it bigger. This house is not long enough. You want it longer. The main entrance is too big. You want it smaller. Some other examples from the house plan. 
The hallway is too big. The entrance is too small. The bath, o baño, in the master bedroom is not big enough. The back porch is not long enough. There are many new vocabulary words in this lesson. Enough, far away, evaluate, kitchen, living room, back porch, main entrance, cool, buying, bedroom, dining room, bath, and less. Hemos cubierto los objetivos, el objetivo, evaluar y comparar con adjetivos en frases como not, enough, y to. El uso de estas frases es nuestro con contenido conceptual. Thank you for your attention.